first up, we are going to do a reading on Shane Dawson. So I want to see uh, what exactly is happening with Shane, like his direction, um, you know, where he's headed, things like that. Um, let's see, because I know he's done a lot. Uh, L, thanks for the thousand bits, I appreciate it. I know he's done a lot recently, um, and I know he's taken his break, which is well-deserved, and we did love the Jake series, but let's see where he's headed. Let me switch the scene here. Hmm. Okay, um, consider Shane uh, someone who can accurately and confidently say lesson learned. The chariots reverse, which says he's going to be changing a lot. So it's gonna be very different and the format is changing. Um, with the death card upright, uh, the death card is a complete uh, and utter change, um, and the chariot obviously is a halt in progress. So between these two, 100% um, going to be seeing Shane I mean, you're you're going to be shocked. Definitely going to be reinvigorating and reigniting uh, whatever idea he has. Like, let's just say that from the Jake series, he's learned his lesson. Uh, the Four of Pentacles is upright, which is about greediness and selfishness. So he's fucking frustrated. He's very, very frustrated, extremely frustrated uh, about how much he put in versus what he got back. And so he's taking the criticism and he's changing it you guys want to change you're gonna get it you might not like the change but he's gonna do it just to prove a point the empress is reversed so the empress when it's reversed is a lack of commitment and a lack of self-care so shane needs to take better care of himself uh and i think a lot of his new content uh, when it's about him is going to be based around him learning to take care of himself. I think that the last uh, series kind of was a wake up call for him because my seven of cups is upright with the with the uh, ten of wands right here. Uh, the ten of wands would be burdens and the seven of cups would be like a fantasy. I think he's kind of sick and tired of pretending that everything is okay. I actually think you're going to get even more vulnerability from him and I actually think he's going through a very sensitive time. He will be going through an ultra sensitive time. Um, so I've done readings on Shane and Ryland many times. It's always the same. This is their love. Um, there has been and consistently is an issue with boundaries for the two of them. Uh, the Six of Wands is also reversed, which tells me that there's some stuff that they've been hiding, some fights and some disagreements that's going to be exposed. I'm not surprised. I've seen this in their relationship reading many months ago. I've seen it consistently. There's a lover's card, so they do love each other, but there is issues from the past that they are going to regurgitate and fight over, and it has to deal with Shane lack of self-care and self-love um the seven of pentacles is reversed with the magician reverse and the nine of wands shane's gonna have his hand forced because i'm gonna be honest with you some tea is gonna leak um this means that tea is gonna leak from an outside influence or from some gossip or anything like that and shane is going to have to address it this will be happening sometime next year the High Priestess. It's someone they thought they could trust with information it's going to leak. The Nine of Wands is reversed and the Eight of Cups. It means he's going to have to lose a friend over this. Yep. Yep. Distrust, disloyalty, a separation, and him being alone. He's going to lose a very close friend. Yep. Uh, the Judgment card is upright and the Hermit's upright, which is about being alone. The Judgment card would be everyone's opinion of him and the Two of Wands. He's going to get very frustrated. He's going to lose someone close to him. Yep, the Ace of Swords uh, would be uh, a brand new opportunity, though. And the Seven of Wands is reversed with the King of Cups. He's going to make an ally in someone he never would have thought he could have ever made an ally in. It's a King of Cups. Someone uh, who seems insensitive on the outside, but is actually one of the most sensitive people. And it's definitely going to be someone that he is not going to expect. He's going to make a new friend or a new ally. The Ten of Pentacles is reversed as well, which means that I'm not quite certain that he's ever... I'm not quite certain he's ever encountered this person. If he has, he's avoided things because of what people have said about them. Eight of Swords and Five of Swords. So, it's someone... It's someone that someone else that he knows had a bad experience with. It's an unlikely alliance. Get ready for it. Get ready for it. 